So um, I'd train the leaders first to a green belt level. Now we use leading edge, who I found very useful. Um, and it's important to train the leaders first. Second of all, um, I train them in group problem solving. Uh, how to have conversations around change, how to solve problems in a group, and some, some useful things to learn around that subject to the 4N chart, which I'll show you in a minute. The six hats uh, and the talking stick. The four ends and the talking stick are very easy to learn and very easy to implement. Thirdly, um, I'd, after the training, we'd construct a huddle board. That would be one of the projects for the team leaders. Uh, the huddle board is your scoreboard of how the department is performing, using metrics that are important to customers, not KPIs, important to customers. Uh, fourthly, we'd use the huddle board daily, so it would be updated daily, um, and it would be the place you go to to talk about the changes, what needs to what needs to happen the next day, so we can improve performance continuously, and that way everybody knows that change is happening. Uh, fifth, see, do, teach, uh, as uh, Simon Dodd says, see it once, try it, don't be afraid to try it, and by teaching it to others, you'll get better at the task and you'll spread the learning, spread the knowledge. Read Three Wins, again by Simon, who has been a partner of Leading Edge in the past, uh, a vascular surgeon from Birmingham uh, with a background in computer science, uh, probably reads about 10 books a day, uh, but his Three Wins book, really the title says it all, you're looking for wins from all the major stakeholders, the patient, um, the, the people in the process, and the organisation, it could be financial, it could be risk, um, but that's a very practical insight into how you apply lean thinking to health care. Um, uh, so just to summarise, three, four and five in green uh, are essentially leader standard work. So it's important to implement leader standard work before you start telling everybody else that you want to come up, them to come up with a way of working. Okay? Uh, it, it's like everything, you've got to lead on this and people have got to see you change the way that you lead before they'll do it. Uh, so some language that, that I think is important to promote in order to achieve this is systems thinking. Uh, as espoused by uh, the publication The Nun and the Bureaucrat, again from Theta Care, excellent. Uh, has, it's a book and a DVD. Um, be patient or customer focused in what you're trying to achieve, uh, not focused on what's in it for me. Um, and then use language that's specific to stakeholders. Uh, sometimes it's, it, I like to think in terms of weeks because over 12 weeks I can illustrate an improvement in performance fairly quickly. If I'm talking about annual budgets, um, you know, where's the improvement there? So. Talk, instead of talking about 25 million a year drug spend, talk about half a million a week and say, you know, I want the training because we're going to save you this in a week or two. Uh, so language is critical uh, and the more you promote uh, a common goal amongst the multidisciplinary team, the more you'll get buy-in. Uh, I'll try and share my photos uh, through the chat network for anybody who's interested as well, it might be sort of a, a seed for some, some stimulation or give people some thought uh, to see how they might uh, change things in their own department for the better. Mm -hmm.